वेलकम टू आवर मल्टीफांगशनल नैनोमेटेरियल लैबरेटरी हेयर मेनली आवर रिसर्च टीम फोकस्ड ऑन वेरियस रिसर्च एस्पेक्ट्स लाइक पॉलीमरिक सुपर कैपेसिटर्स ईएमआई सील्डिंग मटेरियल्स एंड पीजीएलएटिक मटेरियल्स नो पीजीएलएटिक मटेरियल्स आर नोन टू हार्वेस्ट एनर्जी फ्रॉम वेरियस मैकेनिकल सोर्सेस व्हिच कैन कन्वर्ट द मैकेनिकल स्ट्रेस और मैकेनिकल एनर्जी इनटू इलेक्ट्रिकल एनर्जी why this is so important just to think about we are living in a world nowadays which is known as the electronic world now can you think about we are living in a world without any electricity so with increasing demand of electronic applications the energy consumption so some day will come where we will lose the source of our fossil fuel availability so what is the alternative way that we can develop to harvest mechanical energy to electrical energy or some other energy to electrical energy so there are many process i mean many technologies available that we can convert from various sources but among them from solar chemical thermal among them the mechanical energy source is the abundant and everywhere it is available so if we can convert this mechanical energy to electrical energy so we can save our world from uh, the crisis of electrical power consumption now here in our research efforts with a year long efforts we have come up with the piezoelectric materials which is already known where by application of pressure it generates electricity we have come up with an idea if we can design a piezoelectric nano generator which which is mainly bio compatible and bio degradable that can be used for healthcare applications so that promoted us to carry out this research work and we have come up with the idea of using onion skin which is a cellulose based structure which is thrown away as a garbage in ton scale worldwide every day so this is the onion so if you take this onion skin it will give you the electricity so this peeling onion is always have been a, a loving task now if you brave your tears or courage it to peel more onions it will reward you by producing or generating electricity and to do this all what you have to do just take the onion skin encapsulate it and connect it through the wire from the two opposite surfaces and apply some mechanical pressure that's what so with the development of this kind of material we can generate mechanical energy to electrical energy from very small mechanical stress arising out from the movement of the body from jogging from walking from swallowing and during speeching and all those things and it has the sensitivity as such a high that it can it can uh, sense the heart pulse by producing some uh, signals and uh, that is why it it is uh, uh, mainly it can be used in healthcare units to monitor the heart rate and all those things and it can be used as a uh, self charge sources for powering up the pacemakers but if it degrades that question is that is it harmful to the body or no because when once it degrades it produces it generates a huge amount of antioxidant which is useful for our body to fight against the cancer to fight against the anti anti inflammatory agent from uh, fighting against the allergies and all those things now how how we have prepared and what are the tests we have done that uh, my student mr sumanth kumar paran will show and this work has carried out in collaboration with my research group and research group of professor jin kon kim with my former phd student dr sandeep kumar maithi at postex south korea so we will show you how we can uh, produce this and you have to peel out the onion skin and then uh, and then you put it the uh, upper portion and below portion by gold sputtering and this is the final device and this is the uh, one one unit of the device which is highly flexible and this small device which is kind of a banded kind of structure it can produce more than 20 volt simply by finger and cutting process and can light up more than 20 leds so connection of this kind of six uh, units all together in a series it can produce more than 120 volt current and that uh, and uh, it it can light up more than 80 leds and making this as a banded kind of you just stitch it to the throat you can give you the electricity this work has recently published in our uh, nano energy journal and which is being now 
covered by the several news media, more than 60 medias all over the world. 